thank you so very much for joining me. I am Lisa of Lisa Bow Vintage and over Christmas some vintage friends of mine and I we did a vintage gift exchange called Nelster Secret Santa and this was a group of people from the vintage fashion and accessories group on Facebook. We've got friends from around the world, throughout the United States, Canada, the UK, Australia, and Germany. So it was really neat to see everybody's reactions and all the different packages that were shipped from around the world. Eleanor was my Elster from the UK and I'm very grateful for the items she gave me. First off, when I opened up the items, there was this beautiful vintage postcard on this Christmas card. And it says to Lisa, wishing you all the best in 2022. And the postcard is dated around 1920s to 19, or 1910 to 1920s. So it's nice that it's got a little bit of an era to that. So it's nice to know for that. The items were also wrapped in this really beautiful silk scarf by Vera. And it's beautiful coral, roses with some green fauna. And this is so pretty. I wear scarves on my head or around my neck for work, so this is beautiful. We'll certainly get a lot of wear. Inside the scarf, there were some other items. One of the items is this beautiful tapestry and embroidered purse, which I think is brand new. I don't think it was ever used. It's in impeccable shape. And, you know, the gold along the top, it's pretty well perfect. And the kiss lock works perfectly. There's no tag, but that's all right. And the inside, there's there's no marks, no scuffs. And, well, maybe the occasional cat hair, because I have a kitty. But, yeah, aside from that, just absolutely beautiful. I don't have one that looks like this. So this is beautiful. Inside the purse, there were some other items as well. One of them being this beautiful vintage embroidered violet handkerchief. There was also a compact, which is so lovely to receive. It's petty point, so it's very small stitches making this beautiful floral pattern. And when I unzipped it, the tag, or I'm sorry, the zipper also says made in West Germany. There's a mirror, oh, there's my carpet. <laughs> and then on, this was the part where the powder would have been. So there was a little bit of pink powder in there, so so that's really neat. So for rouge maybe, or some blush. There was also a fun change person here with that fun spring, spring lock or spring mouth purse. It actually says that there. <laughs> it's really neat to see dead, dead stock vintage items. You don't see that very often. It's very cool that it's got an L for Lisa, but also too, I believe that's the symbol for pounds in Great Britain. So this is really neat. Awesome to keep change or, or bills in. There were also two brooches that were inside the purse. And one of them is Scottish Heather. So that's very pretty. Love brooches, especially floral ones too. And this one is very neat. This one is handmade. It's got a little safety pin for a clasp. And it's hand painted. How beautiful is that? It's got a little boat. I must love anything nautical. And nature scenes. So that's so pretty. So that's very beautiful. These will certainly get a lot of wear. And last but certainly not least, there's a beautiful necklace. I collect pottery called Wedgwood. It's right over here. And I've got a display that goes all the way down. <laughs> and Wedgwood also made jewelry in this particular pottery called Jasper Wear. And I was gifted this beautiful Jasper Wear necklace. It's really hard to see the pattern, but it is a warrior or somebody in a chariot in blue Jasper Wear. And it's really lovely because Jasper Wear is very um, smooth to the touch. It's very neat. It, it doesn't look like it's glazed, but it's really pretty. And I have actually a piece of pottery in my collection that has the same pattern. I'm just gonna show this to show what the design is inside the, per inside the necklace. But you can see the, the person there with the, with the horses. So some of the Jasper wear, a lot of it actually is, uh, almost seems like it's got a Roman or a Greek kind of design to it. 
So that's what the pattern looks like on the inside of the necklace. So all beautiful items that Eleanor had gifted me and I'm so very grateful to receive them. They will all get a lot of use and wear. I love them all. They all fit different parts of my vintage collections perfectly. So thank you so very much for joining me today. And wherever you are in the world, I hope you're warm, cozy, and safe. And you know, going one day at a time with all the wildness that's going on in the world. And thank you for being a part of, of my world today and I wish you a lovely rest of your day and take care.